I'm out here doing shit with my face and we live. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Hello, good evening. What's the deal? It's your girl Monique and we are here for some what's up with the plan this content regarding Venus being in the sign of cancer, July 17th until August 10th. Thank you guys for all the continuous go to the order shit thank you guys for all the continued support bookings like shares comments subscribes recommendations tips all that i really appreciate it to book a personal tarot reading with me my price and my contact information will be in the description box down below or other info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section make sure that you are liking the video and subscribing to the channel because it keeps me and what y'all run did shine uh the side effects of this transit home body syndrome fire signs don't be surprised we just want to kick it just with you all right if you want a little bit more alone time or kind of you know uh value your alone time a lot more during this time um and prioritizing self as well as self-care making sure you're getting your chores responsibilities done as well as taking the time out to like i said take care of yourself all right so you could have sun or Venus in a fire sign or your sun or Venus could be in one of the fire sign houses. So the first, the fifth, and the ninth, okay? Your sun or Venus could be in the first, fifth, or ninth house and some messages in here can definitely resonate with you. Let's go ahead and pull this weekly Oracle message card to see what your overall energy is going to be during this transit and then we shall do a spread for you, okay? Spirit guys, how is this Venus in Cancer transit affecting all fire signs? July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022. I don't know. Some of y'all trying to get ready for something, get pumped for something. It's like trying to prepare yourself for something, fire signs. Excuse me. How is Venus in Cancer transit affecting all fire signs? July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022. It might do you some good to go check out the water sign reading because they had this car show up as well. Resting period. So whenever you off, you ain't off. Okay, so some of y'all, whenever you guys, you're going to have some free time over these next few weeks. But I feel like in that free time, you need to be doing something. Okay, self-care. That's what the heart is for. Um, the phone. Okay, checking your emails, re uh, responding, replying. Okay, you know, uh, yeah. Okay, the broom is here. Cleaning. Okay, I just feel like five times you got some free time over these next few weeks. Make sure you handle and some things that maybe you've neglected okay or need to catch up on you're always on my mind okay so fire signs there's somebody here outside your energy who has been thinking about you okay some of y'all i'm gonna be real whenever you kind of ain't got nothing going on you got some free time you think about this person as well excuse you girl all right let's go ahead and do the spread okay justice energetic law okay uh the give and take spiritually okay so some of y'all with the justice card uh could be in the space of realizing like i don't know if you got legal shit going on right now um it ain't gotta be that but this for me is realizing what you need to give up to get what you want or to get what you want what do you have to give all right knight of wands and the justice card yeah, like gives me this energy of like, if you want to get to Florida, you got to go through Georgia and South Carolina from where I'm at in, in North Carolina. You got to go through South Carolina and Georgia to get to Florida. So I don't know if some of y'all traveling over these next few weeks, but some of y'all, um, it's like you got to go through something in order to get to somewhere. I'm sorry. It was just real generic for me. Okay. Sad just could be uh, relating to you specifically, but we are in a fire sign reading. Spirit guys, how is this Venus and Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? That's how we started shit off fire signs. Okay, girl, what is this? Three of swords with the two of swords. So this for me is being in, feeling like you're a little bit hurt. Because you don't know where to go. And I say you don't know where to go because the two of swords is on the bottom of the deck. And this for me is being at a crossroads. Should I go left? Should I go right? Well, if I go left, this will happen. If I go right, that will happen. All right. I just see some of you guys have been blocked off from something. Okay. With the three of swords, like you can't go down this road. It's a dead end, basically. Some of y'all are being blocked from going down a certain path. That with the three of swords, it might be a little bit painful for you at first. It's like, well, shit, where do I go now? But it's like, well, girl, not down there. Okay. 
three plus two equals five of swords. So yeah, this for me is a it's a it's a mental thing going on. Some of y'all need to be careful about um the I call it the background noise. It's like with the five of swords, like too much input. All right. It's like oh, the only person that need to know where you going is you. Okay. So this could be a need a need to know basis the way you know only certain people need to know certain things about what's going on with you. Or oh, like I said, excuse me, you need to be careful about having too much input into as to where your destination is. Fire signs. Yeah, hermit card. I stand alone. Girl, I don't know what the fuck is going on. With the hermit card, it's like you the only one that's going to be able to walk this journey, yo. So please make sure that you are wise enough and or accepting the wisdom to know where you headed during this time, okay? And having the wisdom to kind of like outgrow certain things, uh, outgrow certain ways of thinking, doing, being, all right? Yeah, it's like since some of you guys have been in this kind of like crossroads energy hermit car, you might have been a little bit closed off. It's not, I'll, <laughs> it's not icebox where my heart used to be, but it's definitely, you know, giving Michael Jackson, leave me alone, okay? I don't care what you say. Spirit guys, how is Venus and Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? Knight of Wands with the King of Pentacles. Some of y'all got to rearrange some travel plans. Three of Swords and the Knight of Wands. The original uh, plans. I say travel plans is Knight of Wands. He be out on the road again. But some of y'all did some um, some sort of plans that I feel like you're going to have to um, shift and or adjust. Otherwise, it just might not wind up happening. Like one way of doing things, one plan that you guys have, it ain't going to work out. Right? So, <laughs> I said rearrange that. Some of y'all, there's some reckless behavior that ain't going to lead you uh, nowhere, okay? Knight of Wands for me can be, he does, he is open to trying new things. I mean, that is a plus for him, but he tends to be a little bit reckless, okay? It's like he's uh, restless, really. It's kind of hard for him to stay still. Some of y'all need to be careful about this being a negative, all right? Like, you can't stay put. So it's hard for you to kind of, like, set up shop anywhere because with the Knight of Wands, you get bored easily, all right? Or you a little bit, you, you, they give me the energy of you, you not want to be tamed, okay? Well, girl, I need you to do that. Because with the King of Pentacles here, this relates to your stability, all right? Your foundation. Okay, girl, I see some of y'all not talking to some earth or air sign. I see why, though. With the Three of Swords and the Knight of Wands. Mm -mm. Like... Shit, it give me an energy of you might be single, but they might not be, okay? Because it's higher fantasy. here. This person could be coming out of a certain separation, or they like to act like they separated with the Knight of Cups, girl. I just see there could be some air or earth sign energy that you like. Nah, girl, I don't even talk to that person. Because, like I said, they could be separating from someone. They could still be involved with someone. And you just like, nah, girl, I don't want to deal with that. All right. Some of y'all, somebody here just not your type. With the Ace of Swords and the Three of Swords, you might not want to say the truth because you know that might hurt their feelings. But some of y'all just don't get somebody at the time of day because they're not your type. It's like, I'm not interested. This person could be very boring, very mundane, very routine, very blah. And with the Knight of Wands, it's like, what are we even going to talk about? Spirit guys, how is you rude? Spirit guys, how is Venus in Cancer transit affecting all fire signs? July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022. You're not. Okay, rude would be you wasting this person's time and you know you will not even like them like that. Spirit guys, how is Venus in Cancer transit affecting all fire signs? July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022. Oh, girl. Ten of Wands. Your yeah, water signs have the same energy. I just don't want to deal with nothing. Okay, three of swords, nine of wands, and ten of wands. Some of y'all could feel like, you know, you went, you went between a rock and a hard place. It's like, I don't know what to do right now. Like, with the nine of wands, I just don't want to deal with anything. The nine of wands is like, man, fuck it. I'll just leave this bitch. 
some of y'all need to be careful about doing that. It's like feeling like you're in a hard position, so you just decide to wild out, okay? No, don't do that. Don't act out because you don't have the solution yet, okay? With the Knight of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck, I am seeing there's a need for you to be very resourceful, very strategic during this time. All right, you acting out, wilding out, Knight of Wands, you just kind of like not taking care of your responsibilities, Ten of Wands, letting things pile up on you. Girl, it ain't going to lead you nowhere. All right, Three of Swords is here. Sag, I'm seeing this heavy for you, girl. All right. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles, Hangman, and the Judgment card. It gave me the energy of while you're in this resting period of feeling like things are very slow. Slow motion better than no motion with the Knight of Pentacles. Just because this isn't moving forward doesn't mean that other things in your life doesn't need your attention, effort, time. It just gives me the energy of move accordingly during this time. Fire signs with the Judgment card. Yeah, I'm hearing in these moments is where your true character is revealed. All right, so it gives me the energy of being in like a hard space. Um, things aren't, you know, ideal. So it's kind of like seeing like how you going to act. You know what I'm saying? Like how are you going to handle yourself while things are like this? Are you going to be impulsive, reckless, restless? Okay, or with the Knight of Pentacles, are you really going to... You know what I'm saying? It's like, you know, nah, like I got I got a plan. All right. Spirit guys, how is this Venus and Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? Fool card with the page of pentacles. Anything can change at any time. That's why I feel like it's very important for you fire signs to make sure you keeping up. Like with the fool card, the fool card for me is a little bit of a chameleon energy. Excuse me. He can adapt to anything. All right. Some of y'all, oh, what is this girl? Miss Store or Mrs. Interessante. So a lot of you guys are definitely what they would say uh, out of the norm. Okay. Not your typical. All right. You're definitely not the average type of person, fire signs, all right? The way that you do things, the way that you think, the way that you move, all right? But sometimes that can kind of get you in a fucked up space. Because with three of swords out here, you know, in the food car, you're not the type to conform, right? You're not the type to do things like how everybody else doing. So, this for you could actually be an advantage. Because with the food car and the knight of wands, it's like you can peace out at any time. But you can do that because the knight of pentacles came out. You're someone here who's very resourceful, very strategic. So if you need to peace out from a certain situation, you'll be all right, okay? It's like you always got a backup plan. So I really feel like it's important for you to have a backup plan for your backup plan during this time, fire signs. This could be in regards to any sort of plans that you have as well. Like if you got birthday plans or like some sort of plans for like the weekend or something like that. It give me the energy that they don't hurt to have a backup. All right. Some of y'all might be uh, realizing that it's time for you to walk away from some um, some breadcrumbs. Page of Pentacles, Eight of Cups, and the Six of Pentacles. This could be an emotional type thing, like realizing something here ain't really, you know what I'm saying, feeding you emotionally. So it could be time for you to, like I said, peace out, okay? This could be a situation with the earth or a water sign. Some of y'all, this could be accepting breadcrumbs from a job. Page of Pentacles, Eight of Cups, and the Six of Pentacles. I mean, it's an opportunity, but with the Six of Pentacles, the Six of Pentacles ain't going to be enough for the queen. All right, girl, that's like, girl, that's like a phone bill for her. All right, some of y'all, I don't want to say you have like a very luxurious lifestyle or nothing like that, but with the Ten of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles, you definitely have big boy bills. And with the Knight of Wands and the World card showing up, you're somebody here who could be a little bit cultured. So you're not someone that's just going to be happy, you know what I mean? Oh my God, I don't want to hurt nobody's feelings, okay? But you're not going to be someone here who's just, you know, basically okay with the bare minimum, 
all right you're not cool with just having your bills paid a little bit of money to buy some zaxby's or chick-fil-a here and there like nah girl i like to travel i like to shop and i like to eat okay so i need money for all of that all right some of y'all could be parents okay you need money spirit guys how does venus and cancer transit affecting all fire signs july 17th until august 10th in the year 2022 Strumph with the three of pentacles. So we got Leo and Sag out here. Yeah, with the fool card and the strength card, some of y'all could be in a space to where it's like, there's no manual for how you're moving right now. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Well, I feel like it could be a bad thing because maybe with the three of swords, you thought you knew where you was going and maybe that turned out to be a dead end. You like what the fuck okay you was trying something new and maybe that didn't work out like how you thought it was um i feel like it could be a good thing because with the fool card and knight of wands it's like well not a lot of it's it's basically a role less travel okay three of pentacles are showing up on the bottom of the deck a lot of you guys are willing to start from scratch you're willing to start from the bottom start from nothing all right it's like you don't want to be handed nothing you don't mind going through the hard work some of y'all could be being urged to be in this energy is where it's like hey you might gotta get your hands dirty all right I got to put in a little bit of extra work than what you're used to, okay? Hmm. Yeah, some of y'all, this could be in regards to being a parent. Three of Pentacles, Page of Wands, and the Emperor. Um, I said there ain't no manual on the journey that you're uh, tra uh, doing and are traveling, but some of y'all, you know how they say there's no book on how to be a parent there are there are but girl you don't really know what it's like until you have your own kid right you can read about it all day it's like you don't get experience from something until you're actually doing it all right so some of y'all feel like could be in that energy during this time it's like you won't be able to say not even say you won't be able to really know how to move through life until you've been going through some shit basically three of swords and the ten of wands maybe some of y'all have been going through that the way you've been going through some shit or you have already and now with the fool card and the strength card you look at life the way it's just like i mean you just got to keep swimming fool card you got to know that you know no uh, how do i say this y'all A lot of you guys aren't attached to the destination. You're attached to the journey. It gives me the energy of knowing that you're going to end up where you want to be. But, I mean, shit, I got to travel this motherfucker first, okay? That's where the, the hardship comes in. The, the hard work comes in. You traveling, all right? You going through a certain journey. You experiencing the ups and downs of a certain journey. That's where your uh uh knowledge will come from you fucking up you stumbling you making the wrong move emperor card that's how you grow and that that's also the uh the the good thing three of pentacles about starting from the bottom three of wands you see the 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 growth that you gotta go through or what you kind of gotta uh you know overcome Spirit guys, how is Venus in Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? Page of Wands with the Ace of Cups. Some of y'all could be trying your best to detach from reckless behaviors, impulsive behaviors, um, trying not to let your... Not your temper, get the boat. They're not emotions because Ace of Cups is on the bottom of the day. This for me is like, you know, you react first and think later. All right. Ten of Wands. This give me the energy of like you just blow up because you are very much stressed. Some of y'all could be trying to catch yourself before you get to that point. Like you go off on somebody because it's just like, I have not slept in six days. All right. Got a whole lot going on in your life and you just blow up. All right. Some of y'all are trying your best to strength card and the food card. Stop that, okay? Some of y'all, this is like I said, also trying to curb some certain um, irrational, impatient, and or impulsive behaviors. 
some of y'all this is just how you doing things nine of wands page of wands and ten of wands there might seem like that's a lot going on for you or a lot on your plate during this time because you're ha how you're handling it nine of wands page of wands and the food card there's no structure there's no scheduling you just just waking up just doing shit all right there's a certain schedule that i feel like would really help you uh fire signs Spirit guys, how is Venus and Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? If you are star card. Okay, girl. Mm. Three of swords, fool card, and a star card. Know that anything that you are blocked from or kept away from. Technically, it's the universe. It's like the universe setting up certain roadblocks in regards to certain paths. Because of the food card, they know you ain't going to be able to, like, do it. Because of the energy that you have. Because of the energy that you um, move based off of. It's like a lot of you guys. like with the food card and the star card. It's like once you know, you can't unknow. Basically. So a lot of you guys, once you start to see, like, the real in certain situations or how, you know, certain things are you can't physically you know be in it you can't be a part of it all right you can't move that way once you know how it really is also with the star card strength card and the ten of wands if some of y'all feel like there's a lot on your plate during the time or there's a lot on your shoulders i'm gonna be honest girls because you can handle it and i hate saying that because it's like girl, it's so fucking cliche but what the what they say all right i'm not going what, what do you say girl I wouldn't have given it to you if I didn't think you couldn't handle it. Or I wouldn't be allowing you to go through this if I didn't think you could handle it. Also, you got to start looking at your own contribution to things. It's like, I mean, girl, it wasn't all just, you know, the unluck of the draw. All right. It wasn't just you just got handed a a, a, a handful of bad cards. You got to look at how you contributed to certain situations or how things have gotten to where they are now, fire signs. That's the real self-assess, okay? Strength card, like being able to look at yourself, look at yourself and be like, damn, yo, I did fuck up in regards to that. And with the nine of swords on the bottom of that, that might be a little bit scary. But with the star card, that's how you heal, okay? Spirit guys, how is this Venus in Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? Six of Cups with the Queen of Swords. Yeah, some of y'all could be um, learning to outgrow certain patterns and their behaviors during this time. Some of y'all, it could be time for you to explore something new. Um, this could be just in regards to um, ventures, businesses, uh, interests. But with the strength card, you know, you got to have the courage. A tree don't start off as a, a, tree, a tree don't start off as a tree. It start off as a seed. Food card, strength card, and a page of wands. Some of y'all have to have the courage to take a risk into going into unknown territory. Even though with the three of swords, nine of wands, and ten of wands, maybe. I don't want to say dust yourself off and try again, but maybe so. It's like maybe you tried something back during a time where like mentally you just wasn't there, right? Or you didn't know how to handle a certain situation. And you could be finding yourself led back to that same situation. But like now it's, you know, calling you to look at things from a different perspective. If you keep getting brought back to a certain lesson, a certain circumstance, or a certain situation, it's because you're not learning a certain lesson, fire signs. Okay, that's bars. Spirit guys, how is this Venus and Cancer transit affecting all fire signs July 17th until August 10th in the year 2022? Hangman! With the nine of wands. Yeah, some of y'all, the spite, the girl, the spotlight is being cast on how you're maneuvering during this time, how you're doing things, okay? Star card, six of cups, and the hangman. Um, there's an outdated way of doing things that's keeping you still stuck and stagnant that's being um, showcased during this time. 
It's like, this is why three of swords, you're not moving forward. Or this is why you can't get past a certain checkpoint. Because you're still holding on to an outdated way of doing things. Ten of wands, page of wands, hangman. Um, it's like you start, but you don't finish. You let other things, you know what I'm saying, get in the way of it. I'm not trying to come down on you, fire signs, but that's just what I see, okay? Hmm. On another note, I do see someone here from y'all past who could be... You know, there's somebody here who see you in a whole nother light. You already know this person. You got a little bit of history with them. Six of Cups. Now, fire signs, either you can't move on from this person. It's like you seeing the... Lord have mercy. Somebody here could be seeing the shine and shit is what I just heard. It's like somebody here wants something to be one way, but it's like, girl, it's not that, okay? Three of swords, fool card, the star card. Can't you see you need to detach from this? Somebody here is being urged to see that in regards to a certain situation that with the six of cups they've been dealing with for a long time. Or this is someone here they got a little bit of history with. Fire signs, be careful about this being you. And some of y'all, I do see someone here from your past that can't seem to move on from you. Heavy on the water, a little bit of air. Aquarius, Libra, maybe. It's like with the strength card, ten of wands, and the star card, you look like a legit survivor to someone. It's like you just keep pushing. Like with the ten of wands and the strength card, you know, it looked like, you know, small things to a giant whenever they look at you. Like you won't ever look like you're really dealing with nothing major. The things people think they can see. <laughs> For real. All right, fire signs. That was your Venus and Cancer reading. What's up with the planets? July 17th until August 10th. Like the video. Leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. My pricing and my contact information will be in the description box down below. All other info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. All right, y'all. I will holler. All right. I'll check y'all later. Bye.